You know, you won't believe this, beloved, but I swear it's true. Most of my life, numerically speaking, the greater percentage of my life was spent believing every time I looked in the mirror that I was seeing a loser. I believed that I was destined to fail at anything I tried. I believed that I wasn't good enough most of my life. And the funny thing is, is that I can honestly say that becoming a pastor began to change all of that for me, but I had to figure out how to embrace my unworthiness as the key to my success. (laughs) I had to figure out how blessed losers are the people that God can most likely succeed with. When you see the Holy Spirit at work, it always changes lives because it is an overwhelming expression of the unlikely, right? And the message of the gospel of Jesus Christ is being expressed perfectly, right? That gets people's attention. And it brings salvation not only to a select group of people, but to anyone who would receive it. And that's why the movement called Christianity exploded after Pentecost, because it became the work of a new chosen, a body of people who were all the same because of the one Holy Spirit that they had in common. Don't be afraid. Don't be afraid. Our Lord is gentle. Our Lord is so compassionate. Our Lord is not afraid of you, and you don't need to be afraid of Him. Ask Him to fill you with the Holy Spirit. Ask Him to fill this church with the Holy Spirit.